What's up everybody? Hope everyone is having a great start to their weekend so far. Jabari Ishmael, four-star defensive end from Christopher Columbus Senior High School in Miami, Florida, has committed to the University of Miami. This was a great addition to the program. Our defensive end unit is just reloading at this point with tons of talent, uh, which is something I haven't seen quite a while at Miami at position groups, you know, defensive end, safety. I think that's the most talented group overall, and we have tons of depth. You know, that's the kind of depth you see at elite power five programs such as Clemson, Ohio State, Alabama. Just a couple schools off the top of my head. Miami slowly at certain positions is building that elite depth, so that's very, very nice to see. I also love what this staff is doing. We are locking down local recruits. We are... Continuing that pipeline from Miami Northwestern, Christopher Columbus, bringing in more recruits to commit to Miami and locking down South Florida. There's only two players in this class, I believe, that are not from South Florida. They're out-of-state recruits, and originally they were born from uh, the South Florida area. I think Deshaun Troutman's from the Orlando area and then was originally from uh, the South Florida area, so was Elijah Arroyo as well. So we're doing an excellent job in recruiting local kids. Manny Diaz strongly believes in building that fence, locking down South Florida. Now all we have to do is win football games. It's more uh, easier said than done. Anyways, Leonard Taylor will be making his announcement August 6th. Look out for that. There, a lot of people a long time ago thought we were a long shot to land Leonard Taylor. Move to uh, present day. We're in a very good position with Leonard Taylor. A lot of people expect him. He possibly may be choosing Miami. Take everything with a grain of salt. Recruiting can change on a daily basis. But ultimately, I think Miami is in a very good position with Leonard Taylor moving forward. Also, mandatory practices, as we all know by now, were canceled due to three players that tested positive. So that is uh, what's going on right now. They are not practicing. So that uh, mandatory practice schedule has been canceled for now. Hope everyone has a great rest of their day and always all about the you.